hello guys welcome to new video in this video i'm going to show you how to make drop shadow text effect like this on filmer x so let's start the video so open filmora and go sample colors add any color for background this time I choose red color. Now go titles and add default title into timeline. Double click on this and type your text. Change font and size as you like. After that, go animation and go customize for animate the text. Zoom the timeline. Add a keyframe in first frame of text. And set position Y to 190. Then go 5 frame later and reset position value by clicking reset button. Then go 2 frames later and change position y value to minus 30. Again go 2 frame later and reset position value. Let's take preview. As you can see our text bouncing. Ok, let's make out animation. Go one second later and add a keyframe. Then go two frame later and change position y value to 30. Then again go 2 frame later and reset position value. Then go 5 frame later and change position y value to minus 190. Let's take preview. Delete extra part of text. Ok, let's create the shadow effect. Copy text and paste on timeline. Then select first text and drag to upper timeline. And drag second text to middle part. Now zoom the timeline. And drag second text to one frame later. Then double click on second text and go advanced. Then change color to black and change opacity to 80%. Let's take a preview. As you can see our effect showing but this is not perfect. When the first animation done, drop shadow of text not showing here. We need to fix this. For this, go animation again. Go last keyframe of first animation part of second text. And change position y value to minus 6. Then go first keyframe of second animation part of second text. And also change position y value to minus 6. Let's take our final preview. Now this is awesome. You can save this text for next use. For this double click on text and click save as custom. Then rename and click ok. Apply same process in other text. 
then go text and go custom just drag this to your timeline double click on this and rename it you can change easily anytime So as you can see our effect is done. So let's export our final project. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe to our channel for more cool tutorial. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.